It's ticking, it's ticking like a clock. It's a clock, how can it be a clock? It's an eternity clock. So Doctor Who the Eternity Clock is the first in a franchise of games where we wanted to deliver an experience that really felt like an interactive episode of the show. It's a side-scrolling adventure game full of high storytelling, high action, big thrills, big scares. Enemy activity detected! Oh, nice cloisters. They could do with a touch more ivy, but I approve. Calm down, dear. Two characters can be in two completely different time periods simultaneously. So one player will be in Elizabethan England while the other player is in Victorian England. Both interwoven and solving the mystery together, but in two completely separate time periods. Hi, sorry, not in now. Please leave your incredibly patronising message after the tone. The features that the PlayStation 3 and the Vita bring to the game are the quality of the visuals. We partnered with Unreal to provide the technology. Now the gaming audience, the players, know that that guarantees you a certain level of graphical quality. What we wanted to do was add something a little bit different. So we have this 3D camera, so as you move through the levels, suddenly you'll go round a corner and the camera will move with you. So that allows us to create really, really sort of big, expansive 3D areas, even though you're still moving left to right. You know what I really hope that players will get out of this game is to experience a Doctor Who story firsthand. What is it like to be in the TARDIS, pressing the buttons on the console, stepping out of the TARDIS doors into a mystery as the Doctor and as River, and to explore their worlds, to be chased by the monsters of the show. Well, I'm not going to go into any real details about the story that we're developing here because uh, that's part of the fun of playing through it. What we have done in this game is given some things for the fans. There's the hat. Everybody knows that the current Doctor loves his hats, his fez, his Stetson. You know, not sure about that. Does a flat cap have enough oomph? For the first time ever, fans will actually get to see the spoilers that are inside River's Diary, find out what she was thinking during key moments of the show, um, and we've hidden some really good hints in there about some of the directions we're going to be taking and some of the future plans we have. 